Once again, ladies and gentlemen, as always, this is the Investor Show. As always, this is your host, Prince Dykes, coming to you guys live, Prince of Investing, from Denver, Colorado. Don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, comment, and share button, and check out the description box of follows on all our social media platforms. But as always, I don't have a lot of time, and I definitely know you guys and girls don't have a lot of time, so we're going to jump straight into it. So as you guys can see in the description box, this video is going to be talking about Option House with E-Trade, how to get an option house with E-Trade, so I'm going to show you how to do it, um, what it is, um, a couple few functionalities about it, but it's going to be a quick video because I think it would be a powerful tool for all you option traders out there, especially the ones that use E-Trade um, to kind of help you out with that. Without further ado, let's get straight to it. You're going to go right up under here to trading, right? And right up under trading is you're going to go to options house. When you go to option house, First of me, if it's your first time logging on, it may ask you to uh, go through, you know, it may ask you to make sure, hey, you use permissions or whatnot. I'm just going to hit the little don't show me this again. But once you come here, this is going to show you um, all of your, you know, this is this is Option House, right? And this is the cool part about Option House. Now, up under here, let's say if you're looking at Google, like I have Google typed in here just to show you guys for example. So you have the quote of Google. Then you have the charts, right? Then you can have the charts where you can look at here in Google. You can uh, look at the frequency. You, you know, you can look at the option chain that you have here. But this is the cool part. You can go over here to a market and go to live action. And up on the live action, you can go to unusual activity or volatility, something that has volatility right now. Uh, right here it says symbols where 30 days imply volatility has gone up at least 30%. Who has a low volatility? And once you do that, you can say, hey, I want to see who got the big volatility. You can hit a run, and it'll tell you all the people that have a high volatility. Unusual activity. Right here, who has an unusual call volume? The highest call volume relative to the average. Who has all of a sudden people just been starting to buy a bunch of calls? You can look at all the symbols here. It'll tell you, hey, this is the average here. But now, look how much it has jumped up. So you can like, okay, well, let me look into this company. Let me add it to my watch list. Boom, you can add it to your watch list just that fast. So you can build a watch list. Um, you can throw things in here. You can hit the add button below. You can look at the uh, market overview. This is, you're looking at the volatility, the S&P 500, the Dow Jones, the NASDAQ, the Russell 2000. You can get news of what's going on. Um, you know, hey, this is news what's going on. So you can like, hey, we have a big decline. Maybe it's maybe an opportunity to buy some stocks. Or you can like type in, you know, the company you've been looking up, for example, hey, I want to see what's the news on Google, what's the latest and the greatest. You can pull that up here and it'll tell you all the good stuff that's going on with that company. And then most importantly, they got a calendar over here. So you can look at calendar for the week, calendar for the month. Hey, look, the month before the market, you got eight coming out. After the market, all these different earnings seasons that you can look if you're earnings and an option player or whatnot. And you can actually buy and sell options on here too by going to trading. You know, you can pull in and decide if you want to buy some calls or some puts. And also, you got the headlines as well. And once you do that as well, you can also, in the trading lab, you can hit the trade button here and just build you an option right here. And on top of that, when you buy it, you can hit the little X button here. I'm going to do more detailed videos to show you, but you can, hey, you know, if you want to do a straddle or if you want to do calls and puts and, you know, all of the good stuff like that, you want to do, you got a straddle, you got a strangle, a call, a vertical call, it'll set it up for you. If you want to do a call and a put, if you want to do a straddle, whatnot, boom. So very powerful tool. You can buy straight out of here, you know. But anyway, that's a quick overview of uh, Option House with E-Trade, how to use it and some of the functionalities. And I go in detail more with it with other videos. But as always, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, comment, and share button. Until the next video, podcast, cartoon, book, or whatever else you see me do crazy around the globe. Peace, be safe, I'm out, and thank you.